Ethnic restaurants from countries around the world employ unique cooking styles that use exotic spices, herbs, and ingredients. A rapidly growing ethnic restaurant trend has resulted in a changing palate in the United States, with more openness to new flavors and cuisines. In addition to dishes such as Indian biryani, Somali samosa, and Ethiopian anjira, popular entrees include chicken, red meats, salads, and cooked rice. In Minnesota, the arrival of Hmong and African-born immigrants have brought the addition of hundreds of traditionally prepared meal options to restaurant patrons. With this comes the huge responsibility of ensuring the safety of the foods that these restaurants serve. The importance of preparing, storing, cooking, and serving safe food cannot be overemphasized. In the U.S. alone, the top five pathogens that contribute to foodborne illness have resulted in an estimated 128,000 hospitalizations and 3,000 deaths per year with an annual estimated economic cost of $77 billion. The highest number of casualties from these foodborne illnesses are infant and preschool children, pregnant women, and the elderly. It is important that you recognize that foodborne illnesses are transmitted to people via improperly prepared food and that the diseases typically result from five different causes. Poor personal hygiene, inadequate cooking temperatures and times, food from unsafe sources, improper holding, which is time and temperature abuse, and cross-contamination, which includes contaminated equipment. Ignoring the safe handling of food is extremely dangerous and may lead to pest infestation, food waste, business closure, legal action, and loss of business. However, when you create a culture of food safety in your environment, not only is it a great source of pride for you, it is also economically beneficial as you avoid legal costs and the possible loss of revenue and reputation due to closure. Keep in mind that the most documented cause of foodborne illness is poor personal hygiene and easily preventable risk. The red meat a customer consumes in your restaurant originates at a farm. All food that comes to your restaurant is inspected during each step of its processing. For example, at the time of slaughter, all meat and poultry are inspected by the USDA. Meat processors are required to have and implement an HACCP plan. There are also food safety laws that guide storage, transportation, and wholesale markets. You are the final step in the food safety process. Food safety starts in the fields. Produce farms are guarded against accidental contaminations originating from farm animals. Before you serve salad, you must wash all produce and store cut greens and tomatoes at 41 degrees Fahrenheit. Did you know that rice and grain products can have spore-forming bacteria after the food is cooked? Improper management of temperatures allow toxins to multiply. Remember, after you cook rice, you must keep it at 135 degrees Fahrenheit until it is ready to be served, and then cool it properly. Serving safe food is a source of pride for operators and servers. Tremendous efforts are placed in protecting food from the farm to your establishment. It is your responsibility to maintain food safety and serve your delicious meals with pride.